I'm making my own wood filler today. really don't have room inside to do all the fabrication things that I need to do. So uh, I have to pretty much um, create my own spaces in order to work. So when it comes to fabricating stuff, a lot of my materials and um, equipment is portable. So so outside is ideal, ideal for me. I'm doing more masks because I have so many materials I have to get rid of. And these are counter countertops that I found. So I decided to use them. So right now I'm just doing some basic woodworking stuff in terms of just filling in gaps and stuff like that. I wish I could I was doing something more exciting today. <laughs> my process there's no certain steps in terms of these masks I start with the raw materials that I find I fabricate them most of the time I refabricate the materials reshape them and finish them so it's kind of like a uh, three-step process Everything I don't find on the street, people like give me stuff because they know what I'm doing. So I got like a pedicure kit and, and I have some wires over here somewhere. I have found parts all over the place. This stuff. I don't know where it came from. This is. So what I basically do, I just, whatever I'm making, I just, I just look at it and look at what I have and, and actually kind of just see if it fits for me. I just really shower heads, old camera parts. Sometimes I even take the stuff apart that I find. You know, if I know it has a lot of pieces within it, I'll just take it apart. But no, you, well, it's always good to kind of try to position things um, before you attach anything. So that works for me best. And that's the way my sculpture teacher worked. So I kind of followed his lead with that. And it's, yeah, it's, it really works well when you work that way. You can get things done faster and you actually know um, how you want things before you really secure them and make it permanent. Oh, I have many lathes, many band saws, many everything. Uh, so to try to make a kind of portable wood machine shop has always worked for me. It doesn't take much. All of, most of my tools are are basically uh, in this box, and I basically can make anything with these tools. Just you know, just your regular stuff. Oscillator. I have surface grinder. I have a wood grinder, so I, you know I don't. I still file wood by by hand sometimes because it takes hand work sometimes for some of the most detailed parts. So you can never get away from it. 
but I just get up um, in the morning, drink a cup of coffee, and and work on whatever I've been working on. Uh, that's pretty much my day. Um, if there's a material or something that I don't have, I may go looking for it. Um, but it's been a while since I've searched for stuff. I've got plenty of stuff right now that I need to get rid of or make something out of. <laughs> yeah.